Hi folks, I'm nice on Android.com where we get on Android every day. Anyway, today we're going to do screen on time SOT test, our high on Android test, where we basically play YouTube video continuously until the phones die. All right, we'll be testing the S7 Edge Exynos version, which is the current king of SOT at 11 hours and 34 minutes, uh, followed by the Nexus 6P. Last time we did the test, it was got five hours and 50 minutes. And we're going to go ahead and test out the Pixel XL and the Pixel. These are brand new phones. Now, in our test, we do not test 4G LTE. We put all the phones on airplane mode. I set the brightness on all the phones to the same using the light meter to 300 lux. And I also set the YouTube resolution to 1080p. They're all connected to the same Wi-Fi. So we will have consistent numbers to compare. Anyway, let's go ahead and do this, baby. Hi guys, so the Nexus 6P ended up at 322 minutes, which is about 5 hours and 22 minutes. And this is on stock Android 7.1 Nougat that I updated. This is a little bit less than 5 hours and 15 minutes on stock Android 6.0.1. We did the test uh, when I first got the phone. But of course, you got to remember that the battery degrades over time. So this is about accurate. And S7 Edge ends up at 372 minutes, which is 6 hours and 12 minutes. Now, this actually scored 11 hours last time. And I realized what happened here. I actually had a custom ROM with a custom kernel, not stock ROM. So that may have skewed the test results. So we're gonna have to throw this out. But the S7 Edge Exynos is actually uh, the king of battery life. And I'll do another one later with stock ROM on there. But I think this is definitely skewed because of my custom kernel on there, which can drastically affect the battery life. All right, uh, moving on, Pixel XL stops at 496 minutes. That's eight hours and 16 minutes. All right, and followed by, followed by the regular Pixel, which lasted the longest at 527 minutes. That's eight hours and 46 minutes. That is very respectable number. If you go ahead and look at my high on Android SOT test page, I'll have a link in the description, by the way, you will see that goes right below the Galaxy S7 and S7 Edge scores. Uh, very similar to the S7 Edge Qualcomm scores. And that's very respectable, obviously, because it is running the latest Android 7.1 Nougat, which is supposed to have better battery optimization. Plus, it's got an AMOLED screen, just like Samsung phones. Uh, it did beat the Samsung Galaxy S5. So of all the phones I've tested so far, it actually comes right next to the king of uh, SOT. So that is very good news. So very long battery life for both Pixel and Pixel XL. And this should be one of the better phones you can get if you want very long battery life. Of course, the Pixel lasted a little bit longer due to its 1080p versus 1440p on the Pixel XL. As you can see, the numbers are pretty impressive for the Pixel and Pixel XL. Very good battery life. Of course, the S7 Edge test failed. Obviously, I totally forgot that I had custom ROM on there, but I'll probably do another test uh, with the Huawei phones. I know they get very good battery life. I just haven't had the time to do it. And also the LG V20. I'll redo the test for this one. The Nexus 6P got about the same, a little bit less. Obviously, I've been using this for almost a year, so the battery does degrade a little bit, but I got about the same score. But that's pretty much it. And don't forget to hit the thumbs up for me. It took me over eight hours to make this video, obviously, because I gotta charge these phones up, set them on my time-lapse camera. So hit those thumbs up, yo. Hit that. Thumbs up for Daddy. Hear that? Oh, there's my, there's my Sony camera. Oh, that was a UPS man. I just got my Sony RX. I just got my Sony A7R2. <laughs> anyway, I have an unboxing of this too. Have a great day, folks. And as always, stay on Android. Click here to subscribe.